forget about the F word, freaky. <laughs> Every man should have a big girl in his world. Now, some of you may prefer a smaller waist over a pretty face, but we all know itty bitty ain't always pretty. <laughs> and to those who reject us or even disrespect us, don't even try to step to us. Those are usually the ones who ain't shit and probably ain't got no dick. And yes, I would have to say that your place is with the woman with the little waist. Because to get with me will require the faith of a mustard seed to move this mountain. Because I need a man that can move me round and round and no need to apologize when your dick can't make it past my thighs. what a big girl is all about. <laughs> See, when you slap us on the ass, we don't feel a thing. <laughs> you get a little rough, woo we start giggling. <laughs> we got more bounce for every ounce and more cush for every push. We know all the tricks of the trade when it comes to getting laid. <laughs> See, we don't have no hollow halls, no shallow canals, and no little thin walls. I'm meeting my sweetie. I can handle it all. <laughs> and big girls, we got hot pockets and we can squeeze them real tight and pull your dick out of sight. <laughs> and you are what you eat. That shit ain't no lie because I've been told I taste like fried chicken, ice cream, sweet potato pie, and you can have it your way because I come supersized in with me. And you don't need nothing on the side. Because a big girl is like a full course meal and you can eat until you've had your feet. And if you prefer breasts, dum -dum -dum -dum, a big girl is your best friend. And to those of us who are lacking in the chest, we make up for it with the rest. Now to my little sisters with a smaller frame, it's time for big sister to get in this game. To my sweet petite ladies, no disrespect. Mm -mm. I'm just trying to warn you. Keep your men in check. Because it's a new day and age and to each his own. But compared to a little girl, I'm a woman full grown. Because when it comes to positions, I got the same capabilities like spreading my legs 180 degrees and making my nose go down to my knees and form on my body like an isosceles. <laughs> That's a train for y'all. Get <laughs> me lovers, pound for pound, bend this over. We a sexual playground. And when a big girl gets horny, I'm a right, you better call for backup. Cause she will tackle your ass like a middle linebacker. <laughs> home to mama. She'll make that shit all right. That's that piece, y'all. Who got next? 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 Who I lose my breath every time you let me pat it. Gotta reach my inhaler when I reach out to grab it. Girl, your love is burning up the oxygen I need. Girl, your love is tragic. On, yeah. Baby, your thickness is a sickness, so it's a blessing to have it. And when you move, it animates like Jessica Rabbit. And I'ma give you 10 carrots just to take your hand in marriage. Fuck you for six days and rest on the Sabbath. <laughs> on, Not to sound sacrilegious, but my Mac is delicious. Baptizing your bath water to contact with your spirits. I will drink your dish water if your majesty wishes. Just anoint me with the mac and the kisses. Girl, you're high as the sun over the desert, that's right. Plus your body goes with the rate that will burn a man's sight. But your heart is cold enough to make his heart turn to ice. So I'm going to lick you in places that will make an atheist turn to Christ. <laughs> Girl, you're, you're 
real thicker than a stack of encyclopedias. I'm talking a D section, E section, elemental P section. Girl, can you picture you and me sweating while we sexing? And I'm all up in those goods like a C section. <laughs> I see setting your body waiting for me to touch them while we crushes went out your couch to see cushions. It's me pushing up and down your deep ocean in slow motion. I'm love sick and needed your potion. Girl, you're the object of my desire. God said round five, you be a liar. May he set in a flame and a blaze like Richard Pryor. Cause girl, you found enough to make a thug pull up his pants and join the choir, girl. <laughs> you better choose your man. Cause your guy ain't eating it right, girl, lose your man. Right. I make love like I make music, man. The only thing meaning to me under the sheets is the Ku Klux Klan. <laughs> Let's go! You better choose your man. The gang eating the right girl, lose your man. I make love like I make music, man. The only thing mean to the meat under the sheets is the Ku Klux Klan. Yeah. town gangster love hit you off like Frank Nitti. Oh. Giving you scar facials all on your liquid kitty. Lick them low in love and they call me the face of the city. Cause nobody give you better face in the city, girl. <laughs> So, so far up in you, it's like an alien probe. Now, every time I get a hard on, I can tell your location anywhere on the globe. Right. Tongue so far up that ass is like I'm in your past. Song so far up in you is like an alien probe. Now every time I get a hard on, I can tell your location anywhere on the globe. Song so far up that ass is like I'm in your past. I can taste your ancestors. Tongue so far up that ass isn't in your past. I can taste your ancestors. Tell you what tribe you came from, which landmass, and which class. Tongue so far up your business, I'm like the IRS. But I'm not checking on your taxes, I'm auditing your climaxes. And from what I can tell, you haven't filed in quite a while. Tongue so far up your business. Tongue so far up your business, I'm like the IRS. But not checking on your taxes, I'm auditing your climaxes. And what I can tell you, you haven't filed in quite a while. Your man complained last time you ate about how long it lasted. Well, if eating pussy was finances, me and your nigga ain't in the same tax bracket. I filed as head of household. I found his head of household. I'm a lick so long, so strong that it damaged the tendons to my jaw muscles, leaving me unable to keep my mouth closed. Ah, man.
y'all know they shooting people up and down these streets. Don't y'all know that this area right here is in a war? Yeah. They shooting people every day. Right, we just gotta live life. Come on, man. I was told that there was only one way a young black male could make it out of this hell. Two choices. Dead or in jail. And it ain't hard to tell that they don't really care about us. Hell. Sometimes I wonder if we really care about us. No trust, we argue, fight, and fuss to let off steam. While others let off rounds, they bust. Straight bullets with no names, we just pray that they don't touch our babies on the bus stop. Waiting on the school bus. See, this savage life ain't all about who's wrong or who's right. We ride or die, quick to get lit. And this high is from my escape, from this reality. Where I'm from, the hood is full of baby mamas, no baby daddies. And in these 21 years, it's hard for me to be happy. Not only do I have to watch out for these crooked ass police, I gotta watch out for these niggas in the streets busting at me for no reason like it's killer nigga season. I need to step off the block. Lord, please give me a sign. See, I got dreams and goals right in front of me, but I just can't seem to make it past the 50-yard line. And if I choose the right path, you'll be rewarded. But if you choose the wrong path, you'll end up paying for it. And my little homies be getting real hungry. They about that life. Got a nigga under pressure. We all know that peer pressure bust pipes. They say we expected to know better. But how when no one else ever corrected you? And you better watch who you point at because once you let them bullets flow, you never know who it's going to be connected to. And some of y'all ain't going to stop until these cops come and arrest you. I guess you let that street life impress you. But I'm here to tell you that you're better than that. I see the best in you. It's your choice. We all have one mind, one voice. And while we worried about street cred and pops, we running out of ticks and tocks on our clock. Because ain't nothing out here in these streets but trouble. Y'all step off the block.